is the time to try another another frappuccino. <laughs> so today we are going to match my colors by trying this one, Dark Night. And we are in the very fancy Starbucks. Halloween masquerade party. Yay, I should have come wearing the mask. Anyhow, let's check out the Halloween Dark Night Frappuccino. However, they have a brighter color, so let's compare that on another day. <laughs> okay, let's see how it's being made. So look at this with this QR code. You can probably attach some uh, Halloween effects to your photo and then of course you're supposed to put it to your social media. And yeah, we are in the very cool Starbucks that is combined with a Tsutaya and it's in Ropongi. So it's one of the big, really big Starbucks. Oh yes, so let's... No, she like she she totally put an entire cookie in my drink. Wow. Okay, so see these uh, are supposed to contain the dark cookie, and she totally took this cookie and added it to my drink, which is the first time to actually see. Uh, I was expecting some flakes, you know, like cookie flakes, but no, it was a real cookie. See, now it's mixed. It's gonna be dumped on top of the berry berry juice. And, ja -ja. and now it's getting the whipped cream on top. And some, oh yeah, some redecoration. Awesome. And done. Oh, oh, I I Yay! Halloween! So, as you can see, next month they have yet another one. <gasps> Lucky! I was wanting this thing the entire day so that I can make a nice video. Now, okay, let me put this on. Happy. Now I have a legit Halloween mask that matches totally my Halloween queen, which is red. Dark red berry chocolate, so it should be like my outfit, right? <laughs> wow, yay! Happy night at the museum, because we are going to the museum from now on. Yay, so before the new typhoon is coming up in Tokyo, we are here in front of the iconic Ropongi Hills Tower. You know, Google and YouTube are up there. And we are going to try this very pretty drink that's supposed to contain chocolate and sour berry stuff. <laughs> First impression is it's like a praline chocolate candy you know those chocolates that inside contain some fruity stuff <laughs> praline oh my god it's really dark let's see So, either because it melted or because I kept it too much, too much around to take photos. However, there is nothing crunchy in this thing, which I personally really like. The berries are not that sour. And yes, very rich chocolate taste. Yes, you totally need a spoon for this thing. 
yes, I'm trying this at night, as you can see, because the name of this Frappuccino is Dark Night. So, it's not only dark, it's even gonna rain. <laughs> So yeah, this is the location, very nice sitting outside of the Starbucks and then even upstairs they have seats. So I actually really like it, it's like a melted chocolate berry chocolate cake yeah. which I usually really like it's one of my like usually okay I'm not that much into chocolate or chocolate cakes but if the chocolate cake should have a raspberry I will be very happy to have it and that's the taste of this so I'm pleased <laughs> enough the frappuccino <coughs> cold mission accomplished it's like a pure red chocolate raspberry cake which I usually like drinkable form so verdict is good maybe I would drink it again <laughs>